a Florida engineer is adamant he spoke with Brian Laundrie on a deserted road near the Appalachian Trail in North Carolina on Saturday morning and as Davis's alleged encounter with the boyfriend of slain Long Island native Gabby Petito comes as police receive tips that Laundrie may be traversing the trail, the world's longest footpath here is no doubt in my mind I spoke to Brian Laundrie, none whatsoever, Davis, 53, SAID dog the bounty hunter's daughter sent me an audio file of Brian's voice, and the voice was the same I heard a lost and dazed man allegedly waved down Davis on Waterville Road, where the Appalachian Trail runs nearby the border of North Carolina and Tennessee hiker has no doubt he encountered Brian Laundrie on Appalachian Trail B. Jack Morford and Jesse O'Neill hiker Dennis Davis believes he encountered a delirious Brian Laundrie while on the Appalachian Trail in North Carolina on October 2, 2021 hiker Dennis Davis believes he encountered a delirious Brian Laundrie while on the Appalachian Trail in North Carolina on October 2, 2021. A Florida engineer is adamant he spoke with Brian Laundrie on a deserted road near the Appalachian Trail in North Carolina on Saturday morning. Dennis Davis's alleged encounter with the boyfriend of slain Long Island native Gabby Petito comes as police receive tips that Laundrie may be traversing the trail, the world's longest FOOTPATH dog. The bounty hunter's daughter sent me an audio file of Brian's voice, and the voice was the same I heard a lost and dazed man allegedly waved down Davis on Waterville Road, where the Appalachian Trail runs nearby the border of North Carolina and T-E-N-N-E-S-S-E-E -E -E. he said man, I'm lost. I said what are you trying to find, and he said me, and my girlfriend got in a fight, but she called me, told me she loves me, and I have to get to California, to C-H-E-R I said well, I-40 is right there, and you could take it west to California and he said, I'm just going to take this road into C-A-L-I-F-O-R-N-I-A apostrophe he was worried, and not making sense and I know that was the guy. There is no doubt about IT we have this lead, but no one's doing anything, not even a phone call Andre returned to Florida from a cross-country trip without his girlfriend and travel companion Gabby Petito, 22, on September 1.